And this is the Zig Clean Color Real Brush Set. So, of course, real brush is really important. Um, there is another version of this, which is a spongy tip brush rather than a real brush. And, of course, the real brush tips are filamented tips, so they're meant to sim uh, simulate what a real brush does. Um, I love using these because they help with really small writing. So I'm just going to roll some lines up very quickly. The great thing about the Zig Clean Color Real Brush Set is the fineness of the tips. If you look at that, you can really see, you can see that little filament sticking out. And that's why I love these brush pens, because you can really get super fine writing. Now when I write with filamented brushes, I always write with them vertically. Now you can write with it on its side if you're just using it in a very sort of geometric, simplistic kind of approach. Now the great thing with these brush pens from a writing perspective is you can add a shadow very, very easily. Now, of course, you can also use them for illustration work. So let's get some other colors out. Let's read. So you can remember to press, jiggle, pull, twist. The great thing about this is, because it's a um, because it's a dye-based ink, because it's a dye-based watercolor, water-based ink. Do you see how the brown sort of has now lifted into that light green, and you get this really beautiful blending? Of course, there are other ways to use it, which is to take a little scrap of plastic. You can apply the color to the plastic, and let's apply a little bit of dark green to this color. You can see that really changing out there. Then let's add some brown to this green. And then take the lighter color and pick up that color that you've mixed up. And so you've really sort of blended those three colors together and they work really well when you do something like this. So I've taken the darkest part of the color to make the stem and I can, I'm using the darker colors as, as the lighter color is coming through. I just need to make sure that I've, that I've taken out all of the color so that when I put the brush back, I don't start with a blended color.